Welcome back to our tutorial series. We're going to look now at how to access some of our recorded classes right on Dojo U. First of all, ensure that you're already logged in to your account. We're going to look at a variety of ways to choose a class and to look at the two different types of classes available on Dojo U. First off, you have our wonderful homepage here with tons of the most recent and greatest content available to you. Let's choose one of these first. We'll choose McNeil's of Ugadale with me, your host. So I'm just going to click on this link here and it's going to bring up the video. This is going to be as simple as clicking the play button on any device, whether it's your computer, your tablet, iPhones, Androids, any device should be as simple as just clicking the play button. Alrighty, welcome to the first of four videos on McNeil. And there we are. And as you can see, we have several controls here. We have the play and pause button here at the bottom. You can scrub and jump across this scrub bar here. We also have the volume control right here in case it's a little too low. And of course, we can go to full screen just by clicking there. And to exit from there, simply press the escape button. And there we are. That's as simple as it is. The next method I'm going to show you is through some of our archives here. Let's go check out the tune index here. Here we are. Here's our tune index. And as you can see, we've categorized all the tunes by marches and sometimes 12-8, 2-4, every type of march, jig, map tunes, pibrock. There's so many. And so the easiest way to find something here is to either choose the category that you'd like, like a 3-4 march or pibrock, or if you're looking for a specific tune, use the, the find function on your browser. So here we go. Let's try and find uh, Castle Dangerous. There we are. It's perfect. 3-4 march right there. So I'm just going to click on Castle Dangerous now. And this brings up classes to deal with Castle Dangerous. Now it may not always be the very first thing because this searches everything from the description to the title of the class. So you might have to scroll through a little bit here, but as you can see, here are some of our Vintage Series classes. Now a Vintage Series class is simply a video of an older format that we no longer use to record new videos today, but they're still 100% accessible on most devices. So let's take a look at Dethrows. I'm going to click on the link. And then, once the page loads, you'll see it's not like our other posts where there's a big play button. This is just a picture. So you're going to want to scroll down, and in a Vintage Series class, you're going to see this link here. Click here to access the recording. And there's also a little post down here if you're having any trouble on a mobile device. So let's click this and bring up the class. This may take just a moment to load due to the buffering that it needs to do before it starts playing. So give it a couple seconds and don't panic if it takes just a moment to load. Alrighty, here we are. As you can see, it's now loaded and it's going to start to play down here. Okay, so you have a couple of controls here. We have the play and pause button down here. We've got your normal scrubber here, which allows you to skip through to different parts of the class. And otherwise, it's pretty straightforward. You can also hide this so that you get the full screen. The neat part about these is they're also highly interactive. So in the same way in a live class, you can also go full screen here. To minimize, you could check out a big video if you wanted to, or again, minimize. You can copy any text that was placed here. You can also download a file over here. Let's download this file. Just going to click to download, 
and bingo, there it is. Now I've got that file. And then just go ahead and click X and you'll come right back. The only thing you can't do, of course, is chat to people. So there you are. Once you're done, go ahead and close the tab and you'll end up right back on Dojo U. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you again soon.